You've heard the old saying, an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure, and that holds true for one of the simplest preventative measures we can take. Here is Dr. T. Glenn Pate. Think about all the items we touch every day, our clothing, our food, cars, and doors, and you add on top of that all the people we come into contact with. There's no doubt about it, we deal with an awful lot of germs every day. That's why we're here at UMS in this laboratory to learn more about all those germs. You know, your body's covered with millions of germs or bacteria. I came to the lab of Dr. Thomas Kelly to find out how many germs are on our hands. We tested my hands before washing them and after. Here you see just how many germs were lying around on my skin before and after I washed them. Washing your hands is a, one of the single best things you can do to uh, prevent disease and good old fashioned soap and water, warm running water, soap and water for 15 seconds, that'll do the trick. So how about hand sanitizers? How do they compare? It's pretty good. I, I don't know if, if it's exactly just as good, but I think they're comparable. He also says no need to become a germaphobe. Just practice good hygiene and you should be just fine. There's a lot of press about uh, infectious diseases being spread in, in places, but in, in public places. But if uh, we follow common sense, wash our hands frequently and with warm soapy water for at least 15 seconds, um, this should prevent most most problems. For today's THV and UAMS, I'm Dr. T. Glenn Pate.